welcome to anji math channel now let us discuss one more question from the probability the question is the box contains 100 cards marked from 1 to 100 if one card is drawn at random from the box find the probability of that it bears a single digit number a number which is perfect square a number divisible by 7 a prime number let us see you are given by 100 cards. So, our sample space is set of uh, first 100 natural numbers. Which means total number of possibilities are 100. From this 100, what are the events we are given to find their probabilities? First event is let it be some a a single digit number see as you know first nine uh, numbers are single digit number so one two three up to nine nine cards will be having single digit number so our favorable outcomes n of a is equal to nine implies probability of getting a single digit number is total 9 favorable outcomes out of 100 second one is a number which is a perfect square let the event uh, b is equal to a perfect square perfect square see what are the perfect squares that is the square numbers 1 4 9 16 25 36 49 8 square 64 9 square 81 100 totally there are 10 square numbers that is uh, number of square numbers favorable outcomes are uh, 10 which implies probability of getting a square number that is a perfect square number that is 10 by 100 10 10 gets cancelled you will get so this is the probability of getting a card having a perfect square number next uh, let us go for the third one at the third event as c which is uh, a number divisible by 7 you know number divisible by 7 is nothing but multiples of 7 what are multiples of 7 from 1 to 100 7 14 21 so on the last one is 98 which means there are 14 multiples of 4, 7 are there so number of uh, favorable outcomes are 14 so probability of the event c that is a number divisible by 7 is n of c by n of s which is equal to 14 by 100 that is 7 by 50 and the fourth one is a prime number let the event as uh, d d is the event of getting a prime number from the cards as you know how many prime numbers are there 2 3 5 7 11 13 if you go on the last prime number is 91 93 95 97 so how many prime numbers we should have some understanding here there are 25 prime numbers in between 1 to 100 so this is your uh, number of uh, favorable outcomes that is n of d the prime numbers from 1 to 100 are 25 so probability of the event d is Getting a prime number is n of d 
by n of s that is equal to 25 prime numbers out of 100 which means 1 by 4. So this is how we will write the properties of the required events. Thank you. I hope you understand.